Remember sea monkeys when you were a kid? You'd add this special powder to a glass of water and shazam, an instant family of tiny creatures. Well, growing sea monkeys or artemia on a large scale is a lot trickier. But in a world first, scientists here in WA have cracked the code. They look like bizarre and beautiful aliens, but Artemia are actually tiny brine shrimp, and even the biggest adults are only a centimetre long. These little crustaceans, which incidentally have been around for 100 million years, are super breeders. They are ready to reproduce just two weeks after hatching. They are also an incredibly precious resource. You see, all newborn marine fish and crustaceans eat Artemia. So aquaculture industries like fish and prawn farms need these tiny shrimp to survive. That's the formula for the baby fish or the larvae. So with the expansion of aquaculture around the world, you need more and more and more artemia. There is no escape from that. Until now, artemia could only be harvested from the wild, mainly from natural salt lakes in the US or China. So Aussie fish farms had to import artemia that was expensive and often poor quality. But WA fisheries scientist Dr. Sagiv Kolkovsky and his team have solved the problem by growing their own. And it's all happened by chance. Biochemical company Cognis was growing algae to make beta carotene. Then huge blooms of Artemia invaded its ponds, eating the algae. So Cognis wanted to wipe it out. But Sagiv recognized the potential. Instead of killing the Artemia, why not grow it? We knew what is Artemia, we knew how precious and how valuable is Artemia. And at that time we suggested to the company, hey, let's start you know, doing it side by side. It was like asking a farmer to breed locusts next to his wheat field. But Cognis agreed and the Artemia grew like wildfire. What began as a few small ponds has become 36 massive tanks teeming with Artemia, thanks to help from the Fisheries Research and Development Corporation. The Port Gregory facility in WA's Northwest is the world's first commercial scale producer of Artemia. We were told that by world experts that we couldn't do it um, and I guess one of the nicest things is overcoming that challenge and I guess the nice thing also, all of the waste stream from the Artemia production goes back into the lakes, all the faeces um, from the Artemia fertilise the ponds, grow the algae, the algae goes back into the Artemia tanks, feeds the Artemia, so it's a closed circle, so it's sustainable aquaculture. Cognis has already supplied 20 tonnes of Artemia to Aussie fish farmers. The aim is to supply the entire Australian market with premium quality, disease-free Artemia. What we created here is a very sustainable industry that can basically work in a closed cycle with production of uh, algae and supply not only the Australian market but also the world market. At the moment, more than half of the world's seafood comes from aquaculture. In 20 years time, it could be up to 70%. So these microscopic shrimp will help solve a massive global problem.